Hey, what a ball. That's the best luau the nurses ever had. Hey, wasn't that hula dancer sensational? Finest naval action in the Pacific. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey. What's this? Yankees go home. Who do put that up? Dodger fan. Mm. Oh, look at me. Welcome back, Yankees. Hey, food. Did you put up that sign? According to Geneva Convention, prisoner only have to give name, rank, and serial number. Right, Ensign Parker-san? Right. <clears throat> oh, yeah, Fuji, but I mean, you're not really a prisoner around here. Ah, uh, so? You at the party, Fuji here. You at the USO, Fuji here. And you at the hot dance, Fuji at the hot stove. Ah, uh, now, wait a minute, Fuji. Well, you know, you gotta stay in hiding. If anybody spotted you, why well, you spend the rest of the war in, in a PW stockade. Well... Right now, this APW stockade to me. I'll get it, Skip. PW stockade. Uh, uh, yeah, yes, partner. Yeah, yes, Captain Bington. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'll get on it right away. Yes, sir. Right. What do you want, Chuck? A uh, routine assignment. Build an airstrip. What? Uh, yeah. And he said we're restricted to base till it's completed. Build an airstrip in all that jungle? Are you sure you heard right? Well, yeah, loud and clear, Skip. Seven guys build an airstrip on this mud lump? Well, that sounds crazy, even for Binghamton. Well, that's that's what what is. Is. All right, all right, wait a minute. Hold it pipe down, will you? As soon as I can get in a uniform, I'll go over to the main side and get to the bottom of this. So take it easy, will you? I'll see you. All right. All right, you guys, come on. We're giving an order, so let's grab these tools. Come on. You too, Fuji. Not me. Gotta get back to the hot stall. <laughs> Wartime help. Come on, let's move it. All right, I'll take the sledgehammer. Are you sure you can handle it, Mr. Parker? I'm an old sledgehammer, man. What are you talking about? <laughs> Watch that first step. <laughs> through yonder window breaks. It is the moon. Captain Binghamton. Captain. Oh, uh, oh uh, 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 Carpenter. You, uh, what, what is it, Carpenter? What do you want? Uh, I'm just checking this light to see. It seems to be something. What's wrong with this? Uh, 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 what's wrong with the light? Well, it, uh, uh, it's broken. Don't you see that? Uh, what do you want? What is it? Why, why? Well, I just received this message, sir. John Burton and his cameraman will arrive at 1400 this afternoon, sir. Oh, uh, Burton? Burton? John? Burton? Well, yes, sir. You know, the Hollywood director who's coming here to make that documentary film about P.T. boats. Yes, yo, that completely slipped my mind, yes. Aren't you thrilled, sir? Th what do I look like, a movie-struck idiot? Oh, no, sir, never, sir. But Mr. Burton has won four Academy Awards, sir. Five, five. <laughs> yeah. And if everything goes smoothly, he could win another one right here, which reminds me... What about Mikhail and his men? <laughs> They're working, sir. And if I may say so, sir, dreaming up that airstrip assignment to keep them out of sight during the filming. Oh, that was a good idea, sir. Good idea. It was a stroke of genius. Genius. Mr. Burton would ever use those cutthroats in his film ought to be a bigger disaster than Pearl Harbor. Captain Bampton. Okay, what are you doing here? You're supposed to be restricted to your island. I had to talk to you, sir. I, I don't know what you had in mind when you ordered seven men with picks and shovels to build an airstrip, but it's certainly not a good idea, sir. Not a good idea. Why, it was a stroke of genius. If John Burton were ever to pick any of your pirates to be in the documentary film... That's what I'm trying to tell him, sir. I... Oh. Documentary film? Aha! Uh -huh. So that's it, eh, sir? Don't blabbermouth you. <laughs> All right, Mikhail, I'll give it to you straight. John Burton is going to do a film here, and that's why I restrict you and your men to your island, because as far as I'm concerned, you've got the biggest bunch of foul-ups and deadbeats in naval history. Captain, you've got no right to talk like that, no right at all. I've got every right to talk like that, Lieutenant Commander. Now you get back to your island. Out, 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 out! <laughs> Oh, you certainly told him, sir. Certainly did. Just hope I didn't strain my speaking voice. <laughs> Spray. 
spray our rice spray. Oh, thank you, sir. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, sir. I forgot. <laughs> Hey, Skip, are we going to take this lion down? Well, I don't know what we can do. All I uh, sure, I'll go along and say that Binghamton's out of line. But uh, he did give us a direct order, didn't he? But it's not fair for him to restrict us. He's just afraid that we're going to steal the picture. Yeah, Skip, right. if that director ever saw us in action, he'd snap us up in a second, right? Oh. Yeah, 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 right, right, right. right. Sure, great. How's he going to see us in action if we're... If we're... We're in business. Verge! You monkey, you caught the brass ring again. <laughs> what do you think, Skip? Ah, John Burton is going to see us in action. Yeah? Yes, I sir. Know, Binghamton Skip. wants to get tricky. So can we. So can we. <laughs> I'm sorry I was delayed, sir. Yeah, just in time, Carpenter. Here comes Mr. Burton now. Oh, yes, sir. Oh, I do hope you get to play the commanding officer in the picture, sir. <laughs> Binghamton, that mustache. In case he thinks I'm too young for the part. <laughs> oh, uh, Mr. Burton, I'm Captain Binghamton, sir. Welcome to Teratoba, Mr. Burton. It's the fighting as PT base. Hi, Captain. Now, Smitty, will you see that they get all this camera gear on shore? And tell them to be careful, the fishing tackle. <laughs> Mr. Burton, as the commanding officer here, I'm very happy to be able to offer you all of our facilities. Thanks, Buggleman. As a matter of fact, I was going to... That, 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 that's Binghamton, the B-I-N-G. I'll take your word for it. Now, I want to get started as soon as possible, so I want to pick the people that I'm going to use in the picture. That's where you come in. <laughs> yes, of course, of course, that's right. Now, I need a PT boat and crew. Uh, we have several PT boats and crews available, cut, sir. Cut, cut, I... cut! Pardon, sir? That's show business talk for shut up. That right, <laughs> that's right. As a matter of fact, we have no PT boat crews available at all. Uh, however, I think that I can put enough men together under my command to uh, satisfy your needs. Oh, fine, Binghammer. The job's uh, yours. That's Binghamton. Uh, Smitty, I... will you check out this camera gear as soon as possible? As soon as I finish this picture, I've got a date with a Marlin. What's that? Uh, oh, that's just an air raid, Mr. Burton. Now, I think that this picture is... An air raid? on your lip. <laughs> oh, you nitwit, don't you know a mustache when you see one? <laughs> Keep down, mister. Say, you look just like John Burton, a movie director. I am. It's no wonder the nips attack. Boy, what a feather in there, Captain. Knock off a guy directed Fanny of Blueberry Hill. Oh, thank you. Uh, don't worry, Mr. Burton. We'll protect you. Oh, oh ow! <laughs> Are you hit? Yeah, Christy. But it's only a flesh wound. I'll be all right, somehow. <laughs> okay, you nipped. You asked for it. That's for Joe. And that's for Larry. Any requests? Let me up. I keep him down. And there's a zero coming in at 3 o'clock. I don't see any plane at 3 o'clock. You're looking in the wrong place, sir. The nips are on daylight savings time. Oh, <laughs> oh hold it, cease fire, man. We've got him on the run. Hey, hey. Fire. Well done, man. <laughs> Sorry for the inconvenience, Mr. Burton, but it's the war, you know. Too bad you didn't have your cameras ready. Yes, I missed quite a performance. Yes, sir. All right, Mikhail, you've really gone and done it this time. Done what, sir? Well, we'll skip the penny ante stuff like disobeying orders and breaking restriction. We'll get right to the big money, faking an air raid. Well, wait a minute, sir. Can I put in a word here, Bingleton? That's Binghamton. <laughs> and as soon as I settle McHale's hash, Mr. Burton, I'll be ready to start filming. What I wanted to say was that I won't be needing you for the picture. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. And I... <laughs> you won't be needing me? I'm going to use Commander McHale and his crew. Oh, well, thank you, sir. Oh, well, you're not going to fall for that fraudulent air raid. I mean, I didn't see any... Pl Did you see any planes? <laughs> no, but I saw a lot of imagination. With an inventive bunch like that, we should be able to finish the picture in no time. <laughs> to 
stop waving at me, you pea brain. <laughs> now, Mr. Burton, surely you're not going to fall for a dishonest trick like that. I mean, with all your experience, you can tell when some movie struck eight ball is trying to force his way into your picture. I certainly can. Now, about your mustache. <laughs> okay, Mikhail, we start filming tomorrow. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> All right, men. Everybody up. What are you doing? Let's go, men. We've got a picture to make. Mr. Burton, it's the middle of the night. It is exactly 4.39 a.m. The cameras roll at 5. Well, what's going on here? Ah, there, Mikhail. I'll be needing your hut to process film in for the next few days, so we'll get your stuff out, okay? Uh, Attaboy. And there, Mr. Burton. Yep. Well, 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 why, why so early? We've got a rugged schedule, and I'm going to make a great film if I have to work you boys 24 hours a day. <laughs> you are going to change, I hope. My orders from the Pentagon are no cheesecake. <laughs> Let's go. Hammer rolls in 20 minutes. Uh, 20 minutes. <sighs> All right, all right, come on, you starstruck bunch of gorillas. You want to be in pictures? Sorry, now you're in pictures. Let's go. I thought my knees were kind of cute. <laughs> all right, who swiped my comb? Hey, has anybody seen the shoe polish? Hey, Grover, will you let me at that mirror, please? Oh, Where are you peasants for a star? Hey, stop stuffing, will you, Groove? I can't do a thing with my hair. All right, you glamour girls, let's get out. Come on, on the move. Come on, come on, come on, let's go. Come on, Christy. Come on, Hap. Come on, hey, Groove. Ah, boys, you two. Hey, 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 hey. Fooge, where you going? Going to be a movie star. <laughs> Wait a minute, boy. Hey, you know all the big brass is going to see this picture. Do you know what will happen to you if you're discovered? Sure. I go to Hollywood, just like uh, Shari Yamaguchi. No. <laughs> you go into the stockade for the duration of the war. You mean I can't be in picture? Sorry, Fooge. Not even in foreign version? Oh, no, no, samurai. You get out of those clothes and just get out of sight. Go on up to the cave and just eat, sleep, rest. Take a nice long vacation till the whole picture's over, okay? I think I write to Geneva. This is a heck of a way to treat the PW. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you, boy. Take care. All right, men, for this opening shot, you've just gotten a submarine alert and you're going to scramble. And I mean really scramble. Okay, Mikhail? Right, Mr. All Martin. right, let's go. Let's go, boys. Benny, you ready? Roll them. Action! Let's go, Mikhail! <laughs> cut! Cut! Oh, that's no good, Mikhail. It's too slow. You guys look as if you're headed for a sick call. Come on, let's go back and do it again. Come on, boys, let's go. <laughs> No blazes. Keep crawling. Move. Move. I want this to look like the real thing. They act like the real thing. <laughs> hey, they are real bullets. He's burning. Real bullets. Hey, you guys, get down. Don't anybody stand up. You're liable to get killed. Hug the dirt. I got to follow orders. <laughs> Hey, get down, that nutty director. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't know you are the nutty director. Parker, why did you stand up? Now I've got to shoot the whole scene over again. Oh, no, we won't. I'm sorry, Mr. Burton, but using real bullets is sure just going a little bit too far. Well, listen, Mikhail, when it comes to realism, I never compromise. You know why Blueberry Hill won the Academy Award? Real blueberries? <laughs> Enemy aircraft at 2 o'clock. Mr. Burton, you want realism, you're going to get it. Oh, thank goodness, for I was sure need the rest. Battle stations, come on, everybody, let's go. 
What am I going to do in a rain? Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Well, we'll see now if this Hollywood phony's as good as his press clippings. What's that, sir? Oh, they're just staging a fake battle. Oh, that sounds awfully real to me, sir. How do you know? You don't even know what cut means. But, sir... <laughs> and a man doesn't even know how to stage a simple battle scene. I knew he was an incompetent when he picked Mikhail over me. <laughs> Sir, it's a Nip Zero. Oh, Nip Zero? Do you know an American plane when it's painted over to look like a Nip Zero? It's a pretty sloppy job, too. That was a bomb! Two firecrackers stuck in the ground. Pretty sloppy job, too. Holly wouldn't know how. Oh. Come on, boys! You got him! Ah, we got him! Yeah, got him. Hey, hey, Mr. Burton! Hey, Mr. Burton! Was that real enough for you? Just great, Mikhail. A real enemy zero being shot down in a real bombing attack. What a finish for my picture. Did you hear that, sir? It was a real attack. Oh, uh, uh, yes, of course, Carpenter. I, uh, I knew it all the time. Well, then why did you keep telling me it was a fake, sir? Very simple, boy. I didn't want you to panic. Oh. <laughs> oh sir! Oh, my goodness. Well, Mikhail, that wraps it up. Everything's in the can. Thanks again for your cooperation. You did a fine job. Ah, uh, well, thanks, Mr. Burton. But I can't say we're sorry it's over. <laughs> Smitty, get that last real process as soon as you can. We're taking off after that Marlin in the morning. Right, Chief. Thanks again, men. Now I'll be off. After a rough filming like that, I need a rest. <laughs> you hear that, guys? He needs a rest. Now oh. I know why them Hollywood movie stars quit acting and volunteer for frontline fighting. They're cowards. <laughs> nice shower and a hot meal and a couple of days of war and... We'll forget it ever happened. Yeah, a hot meal sounds yeah. great. Yeah, hey, one of you guys better go up after Fuji in the cave, huh? Don't bother, Skipper Sa. Hey. What are you doing in that getup? All you other actors wear this getup for last scene, so I wear it. <laughs> Fuji, are you trying to say that you sneaked into the last scene of the picture? Ah, so. And not only last scene, I sneak into lots of scenes. <laughs> you what? <laughs> Pretty sneaky, huh? Fuji, do you realize what you've done? What? i just trying to break into pictures. Do you realize that when the big brass runs this film on a big screen, that you'll be spotted in a minute? Then they'll just lock us up and throw away the key. Mamma mia. Skip, that cameraman is processing the film right now. Boy, we got problems. Well, we'll just have to wait until Smitty goes off fishing with Bert, and then we'll see if we can cut Fuji out of the film. Yep. That's me. Always end up on cutting room floor. <laughs> well, that wraps it up, boys. See you at the screening tonight. Okay. Wish me luck. So long. Hey, look at the junk they got in here, huh? Hey, so let's try to find the scene that food is in. Hey, this is it. Hold it up to the light. Yeah. Oh. Hey, 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 easy, Fox. Don't hey, step on it. Easy. 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 What a mess. All right, Brent, look. Bring it all over here. Easy now. And just put it right around this thing. We're white. Oh, no. The whole thing is ruined. Well, at least we don't have to rewind it, Skip. <laughs> what do I do now, Skip? Oh, why ask me? I don't know. All I know is we got to come up with a film by tonight. You don't mean we start this all over again. What else? It's worth a try, Skip. Yeah, we have no other choice. Okay, then we're wasting time. Grab the equipment, boys. Let's go. Hey, food. You know how to operate that camera? Of course, Skip Hassan. I Japanese, remember? <laughs> how can I forget? You got us into this mess. Come on, let's get going. Come on, boys, move. Action camera, roll them, we're making pictures! Gee, I love that kind of talk. <laughs>
Hiya, Chuck. Uh, hey, Ross, honey. Sorry for the delay, Admiral, uh, but uh, you see, uh, he had a little bit of engine trouble, didn't you, Chuck? And, uh, and, uh, how's it look? I don't know, Skip. We didn't have time to look at it. Barely had time to slap it together. Okay, ready to go, sir. I hope this is good. Good. It's a John Burton production. It's going to be great. Roll it, Smitty. Right on, Chief. Quiet. I don't want to hear another word until this film is over. or you're going to walk back to Hollywood. Honest, Chief, oh, I don't no, know... No, 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 don't take it out on him, sir. Uh, the truth is that uh, everything that you saw on that screen, uh, I'm responsible for. You, Mikhail? Yes, yes of course. I begged Bert not to use Mikhail and his man, sir, but he wouldn't listen to me. Well, I'm certainly glad he didn't. You're certainly right, sir, because that was a disgrace. What? What? <laughs> Laughter is one of the most powerful morale weapons we have in our arsenal. And a film. As hilarious as this one? Why, it'll do more good than a thousand dull ones. Well done, Mikhail. Well, thank you, sir. <laughs> and you too, Burton. <laughs> yeah, I'm really glad someone around here showed some real judgment. <laughs> you come along with me to the Jeep. I'll tell you about the last Marlin I call. I was only yes. kidding, Admiral. Yes, I, know good funny, Admiral. Admiral. I know it was a funny Admiral. I was laughing. I, I laughed. Oh, uh, don't get mad, Cap. Maybe he can be in our next picture. We got one plan. Tell him. Sorry, help me. No, 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 Cap. And so this citation is presented to the commander and crew of PT Boat 73 for their part in creating an outstanding training film. Boy, that's just like an Academy Award. Hollywood, here we come after all. Yeah, we're stars. Who wants my autograph? Who needs it? Not get off, you wait balls. We're through at the movie business. From now on, we're supposed to be fighting a war, remember? So there's no more of this Hollywood nonsense. And besides, where's Fuji with the breakfast? Fuji! <laughs> you rang, sir? Get out! Yeah! 